Hello, I am Marisa Johnson, one half of Mommy Needs a Break. And today, um, as some of you guys may know, Megan lives in Atlanta and I live in Los Angeles. So whenever we come together and film, um, it's something that's planned out. So in order to give you guys more content, we wanted to release uh, personal content uh, while we're away from each other every Thursday. Um, so these will be thoughts that we have. Um, we'll be cleaning out our house, doing things that we normally do of why we need breaks. Um, so if you guys have any content that you guys want to see us do, um, please let us know in our comments and we'll try to get that out to you every Thursday. Again, we'll try. Okay, so today's video, I'm going to clean out my pantry. I started a few months back buying uh, food containers and baskets and I attempted to do it, but as life happens, it's just kind of a mess now. So what I'm gonna do today is I'm gonna clear everything out. I'm gonna clean out the cabinets, consolidate all the junk that I have. Um, and this is gonna be a two part video because once I clean it out, I'm gonna see what I actually need to keep it going. And then I'll go to the store, buy those things and come back and film another video and show you what I bought and how I'm gonna use it um, based on what I find in this cabinet over here. Okay, so Terrell hates this thing. It kind of is in a way, I thought it was a good idea at the time, um, but it's kind of heavy and I'm not able to really shut the door. So I'm gonna get rid of that. Uh, I'm gonna keep these OXO containers. They're really good at keeping food fresh. Um, I get them at Bed Bath & Beyond. I use the 25% off coupon every time uh, and get a little discount on these. So these work really well. Uh, my mom bought me these baskets from Target. They have like a cute rose gold handle. I'm gonna keep these. I really like these. Maybe I will take some out and put them in our uh, upstairs cabinet. Uh, I haven't decided that yet, but we have a lot of pastas. We have a lot of nuts and berries and rice and grains. Um, a lot of canned foods, a lot of condiments. We are predominantly a plant-based house, so um, I do use a lot of these things, uh, nut butters and stuff like that. So a lot of this stuff we go through and then we keep buying. So I do need to find a home for a lot of this stuff. Um, so again, you know, consolidating, I have two rices. I think I see two oatmeals, two cereals a lot of pasta. So I'm gonna just try to get everything consolidated, like I said, and start there. As you can see, I cleaned up everything. The baby's crying. Um, we put everything away, cleaned up the kitchen. Uh, if you didn't notice, but our power went out yesterday. It was pouring raining and we had to stop, make dinner, uh, get the babies down. So I woke up this morning and I finished up where I left off. So I wanna show you some things that I learned about our pantry. Um, we have a lot of tea. So I obviously need to find a place to put tea. So if you have any suggestions on what I can use to store my tea, that would be helpful because I really want to uh, get away from these storage cabinets with these. And then uh, chips, snacks, I reorganized. We have a lot of toppings for um, smoothie bowls, oatmeal, things like that. So I wanted to make all that uh, present up front, pastas, grains, cereals, I reorganized that. Um, 
that's the baby. <laughs> um, I need something to put Halo's fruit snacks and bars and things like that. So I did put one in a, a seal and then I kind of laid them out here. But if you guys again know anything I could put where I could use to put their snacks in, that would be cool. And then I have a lot of canned goods. So I do need to get, you know, some a kind of tray or some kind of cool thing to stack them up so I can see everything we have. I have a lot of beans. We go through a lot of beans, uh, coconut milk, um, and a lot of condiments. So something that I can put you know, basically all of our cans. Um, potatoes, onions, I think this is pretty cool. I can keep that there. Breads, tortillas, shells, pancake mix. I might need to get a little bit more storage containers for things like that. Um, but other than that, I think it came out pretty great. Um, I love the baskets. I didn't use one. I'm gonna put that in our laundry room. All of our condiments and oils I put up in our spice rack. So I'll make another video where I organize that because that is a mess in there. I'm not gonna even show you. Uh, and that's pretty much it. But I think it came out good all in all. Let me know your thoughts. Again, if you have any suggestions on storage containers, um, things I can put teas in, uh, cans, I would appreciate that. I'm gonna make another video. I'm actually gonna go to the container store or Bed Bath & Beyond and try to figure that out and I'll make another video on that. And that's pretty much it. So I hope you guys like the content. Again, we will be posting every Thursday. So let us know what you wanna see from us. And yeah, have a great day.